Alrighty, so we are here and we are racing again the Offroaders class, well the subclass of Offroaders, which are actually balanced. As you can see we got uh, quite a bit of selection of cars here. There's a Bifta, there is a Karakara 4x4, an Everon, some uh, Red Riatas there I think. I got the Patriot Classic for myself. And there is another guy in that too. So let's see what how we do with this one, shall we? These cards are all supposedly fairly balanced with each other, so hopefully there won't be any issues going into this race in terms of balancing, but at the same time, you know, you'll never know what comes out of it. And just uh, break early. There we go. Yeah, this, this, these cards are big. They are, they've got big hitboxes for sure, and uh, that's why it's not easy to get them around corners and shit. So you need to be careful about this, for sure. For now, I'm happy that I can drive my little box around this track, uh, because yeah, this is a boxy boy, the Patriot Classic. Oh god, that scared me. He almost took me out with his leg even though I was behind him. <laughs> that's some neat tricks right there. And that's who got overtake there. <laughs> Alright, we are in the in the run now. We are actually podium position, which is nice. Okay, let's just not get taken out by others, and that will be good. Also, yes, I know I do have some uh, benefits to this track because I am actually the guy who tested these, these cards in particular on this track, so uh, hopefully it will actually pay me out, but if not, then that's fine. That's just the kind of speaking for the skill of the other drivers, I guess, because I'm definitely not the best driver here at all. Still, I'm catching up to Deviator, or D Dvator, Dvator, I don't know how you pronounce his name. And there is a guy in front with an Everon, I think? Uh, or maybe that's the contender, I don't know. Uh, who kind of pulls away from us, but I think we might be able to catch him yet. Oh god. Leguru is not helping us. And there we go, that's a nice overtake, and I screwed up, cool. <laughs> and that was a nice overtake on his part, I guess. God damn it. <laughs> Uh, well, the Twitch over steer can still happen. And no, I do not mean the streaming platform, I mean the <laughs> the actual car's performance, but still, it's one of the more reliable cars I feel like. Definitely better than a Bifta. Alrighty, let's see. Uh, yeah, he's in a contender. Contender is a good choice. It's a big car, you know, big wheel span, stable performance, all that jazz. And yes, it is still balanced though, so it should not be OP. If he's getting away, then it's most likely due to his uh, driver skill. I mean, not many people actually choose the uh, contender on their own, so I'm guessing he chosen that because he actually knows how to drive that. Then again, it was kind of changed as well, so we'll see. But now I'm just having a good battle with Deviator here. I'm glad that I actually have someone to battle. Oh, that's a cheeky little overtake there. And there we go. <laughs> yes! <laughs> nice. Okay, that was a perfect overtake. Cool. Also, he's pulling away, like way away. Zitsi is pretty good. I mean, I know that Zitsi is not a bad racer, but man, he's just pulling ahead. <laughs> okay, now it's up to me to keep Deviator behind me. I'm probably butchering his name again, but I'm gonna call him Deviator for now. And let's go down to the street. Yeah, the hitbox of this car is actually kind of wonky, even though it's a box. It's not easy to um, always pinpoint where it's gonna creep you into something or when it's gonna get away with it. And okay, I got this corner right, so I actually got managed to pull away and just careful here around because this is where I screwed up last lap. Nice. Alright, our little box is going ahead. Now it's the question of whether I can catch up to Zitsi or not. He's over 7 seconds in front of me, so that's a big gap, but... We got 8 minutes to go from this place, so you know, everything is possible. It looks like I'm actually catching up, which is nice. And the Patriot Classic does not have a good top speed though, so on these sections he's actually gonna pull ahead of me. Got a lap recorder, which is nice. I don't know how many people's actually using the Patriot Classic, but I'm guessing not many. Yeah, he pulled back on that straight. 
I'm guessing I might be able to get some time back on the cornering sections because those are my strengths in this car. But yeah, it's not gonna be easy to catch up to him. In the last race, I think I got second. So if I, if I got second again, that's gonna be <laughs> probably my curse on this uh, this class or this track or both. We'll see. Oh, he actually made a mistake. All right, I'm catching up. All right, it's pedal is on. Maybe he just waited for me. That's I totally expect that from Ritzy. <laughs> he just has a, he just wants to have a little battle for us. All right, the big bulky boys are coming. Why is he going over there? That doesn't really give him much more time. Oh well, I'll take it. Mostly, I I didn't talk about much, but it's nice to have the good old Patriot back in from GT San Andreas and YCT. It's such a nice car this is. I really I'm sad that G Rockstar didn't make actual lore friendly remake of it in uh, Vanilla GTA 5 or online. It, I mean. If, if they were to uh, make any sort of military car into the game with some, um, you know, weaponized crap, then I would have assumed that this would be the first car that they choose, but apparently they chose stuff like the Night Shark and Insurgent and Insurgent Custom and, and all that jazz. Oh, fuck. And I screwed up. Good. Okay. God damn it. That was bad. <laughs> I was not concentrating enough, it looks like. Oh, well. We're still fighting on. Even if not for first, then for second. God damn it! I was catching up as well. Well, maybe maybe Zitsi will make another mistake, and then the whole three pack of people that we have here is gonna be tying up. But now I just, just uh, need to focus on actually battling Deviator. Is my wheel bonked? I think it's bonked a bit. I feel like the car is pulling a bit on the side. Oh well. I think uh, Deviator is already already learning a track as well, so I'm getting harder and harder times to actually catch up to him. Still, looks like I am able to catch back slowly. Five more minutes from the race. I don't know, that's about three more laps, I think. I really don't know why he's pulling over there. The, the, the car can take this full throttle. Look at this. Uh, so yeah, Zitsi is still not far ahead of from us, so I guess we can still bank on catching up to him as well. Again, he just needs to make a mistake. Also, I gave all of these cards uh, ignore Bushes flag, which is nice, so they won't actually have troubles getting around Bushes. And I screwed up that corner. Cool. God damn it, I lost my momentum. Okay. Just work on not getting clipped into the goddamn walls and I'll be fine, I think. I'm seeing that as I <laughs> get dangerously close to a wall. Oh fuck. And I spin out, God damn it. This car does not like bombs by the way. No, oh, God damn it. Yeah, I don't like this corner. This is the corner where I usually lose my stuff. Also, this car was so bad to drive before I gave him the, uh, the handling pass, because it would just uh, flip over in every single corner, but now it's actually able to turn, and without, you know, flipping over, it just kind of spins out sometimes, but that's fine. I could possibly cut off that corner as well. Okay, I got a lap record right after the Deviator had a lap record. Even though I messed up this corner, or a corner on this lap, so I could probably get even better laps. We'll see. I'm better at chasing people than getting away from people, I feel like. But Deviator is already getting better as well, so... Yeah, it's gonna be a tough case catching up to him. And still, I'm gonna compliment him. This is a good battle. I'm enjoying myself. This is all, it, this is all what matters, I feel like. A race can be, you know, uh, really fun even if you are fighting for something like 15th or 10th or something. But it can be really boring even if you get a nice first place out of it. Well, oh. Okay, now they are fighting with each other though, which is nice. That's actually something I can probably benefit from. Okay, that was a tight corner. Probably shouldn't have risked that, but it worked out in the end, I guess. Are we getting back markers as well? We might be. 
It's gonna be interesting if we tie up and actually catch up to the back markers because then we can actually have some RNG in it as well. Alright, I'm catching up to Zitsi but not Deviator. Deviator is actually pulling ahead. Especially if I'm doing corners like this, god damn it. Just keep it going. Oh, God damn it. Let's stop this corner again. Too wide. Hmm. It certainly is a nice battle that we have here. Question is whether I can participate in it or not. I'm gonna try and cut off that corner. Okay, I managed to get the checkpoint, which is nice. I got a personal best bonnet lap record, so the meter is getting better as time goes by. Okay, now we can hold up the back markers. Interesting. Boyka, okay, so they got past. I haven't got past yet. You we'll see. Hopefully I can get past Boyka without having major issues with him. And just like that, maybe. Okay, cool. Alright, Deviator is still not first though, and this is gonna be the last lap if I... Yeah, this is gonna be the last lap. I think. Maybe one more lap in, but I doubt it. That was a panic horn, sorry about that. Fitz is pulling ahead now, for some reason. Did Deviator make a mistake? He might have. Alright. It's gonna be tense finishes, that's for sure. In either case, I think I'm doing alright on this lap so far. Zitsi is just uh, pulling ahead by a mile. I don't know what he did there, but he must have figured something out. Alright, this corner needs to be taken easy. Oh god, I thought I was screaming that. Oh, that was so close. That was way too close. God damn it. Oh. Okay, let's go. That's a random car in the way. That's weird. And it's gonna be the last lap as well. Oh god. And Deviator brought it. Yes! Top two for me. Nice. Oh god. I pressured him enough. Yes. Oh god. Oh, what a finish. <laughs> Oh, nice. Well, did Zitsi deserve that first place, I feel like. The Deviator would probably deserve that uh, second, but I did get the lap record, so I guess I did deserve second place? I did overtake his lap record in the last lap, so... Anyway, that's a good battle.